Of course, when you look at my Google, people, some, especially Europeans, they hate my guts. Mm. But uh, Africans, they love me. Gloria, look at you. God designed you to be a woman. If you have some girl who comes and convinces you that she can actually be your husband, she plays on your mind. She confuses you. She denies you the ability to be a mother. Then she denies the ability to, for you to be a grandparent. Mm. The children you would have given birth will never be. Okay? Mm. And these are people who are pretenders and they're using a lot of information. They've got powerful people like Barack Obama. Oh, yeah. They've got Oprah. They've got Hillary Clinton. And I encourage men, the more you are in the kitchen, the more the bedroom will open up for you because many women get excited when they see their husband working out in the kitchen. They think they're really, really sexy. Hey, when I told my wife that I was going to be on this TV show, you know what she did? Mm -hmm. She laughed. Why did so she I really want to do this TV show and prove to my wife that even I can cook. But now I want to tell yeah. you what I've planned. When mm. you told me you want me to cook, I went out of my way to plan. Mm. This is what I want to do. Uh, I want to do um, chirenge. It's great. It's called chirenge. Mm. So when people get drunk or are getting over hangover, people need more muscle. This is it. That's what builds your muscle. And then I want to do something special called uh, echibero. Is this one I this one I learned when I was in Zambia police barracks because mm. a lot of tribes come together. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. They put everything together. They, they put cassava, matoke, potatoes, it's like fish. A of sorts. Yeah, so yeah. they call it a chibero. So we're gonna do a chibero <laughs> with monokonye. Okay, that's what we're gonna do today. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh -huh. So we wanna go and smoke it. You smoke it for about thirty minutes. The neighbors really get offended. Okay, that's fine. So when they do this, we have a proverb: "Afumbira yebi gere, umfumbira yamu twe." So if you really get annoyed, you also get cow head, and, and you also do the same. So you know, really, that's a great way to keep neighbors happy. Okay. That's what we're gonna do. We set it to work, and by the time I put some spices in there, bam, some uh, curry powder. Mm. So what we're going to do now, mm. you are going to come with me. We're going to go outside to the Sigiri and I'm going to show you okay. how to smoke it. Okay, sure. But make sure the neighbors don't know. Okay. Come. <laughs> yeah, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. So you put that over there. Yeah. It's cow hooves. Mm. Uh, you, you, you get them over there. This is step number one of making a chibero with molokoni. So okay. step A is molokoni. Mm -hmm. And the other thing is, one of the, the other things that I, I always remember looking at molokoni is the last Chwezi dynasty king yeah. before the Chwezi empire ended. Okay. Well, the last king was, Mol I think, Molindwa. He really mm -hmm. loved this cow. Mm -hmm. He had this cow called Bihogo. Mm -hmm. And Bihogo was his favorite cow. And he says, if my cow dies, I will die. Mm -hmm. So then what happens is when the cow died, they, they, they got all the medicine men to find out what has caused the death. They opened the intestines and there was nothing. They couldn't get anything, you know. Okay. But then they brought uh, a prophet from the north, a seer from the north. Mm. And he looked at the cow hooves. And he found that in the cow hooves, the intestines had left the intestine. They had gone to the cow hooves. And he said, this is the end of this <laughs> kingdom. That is how we design. It's very, very important, the cow hooves. Even as I'm doing that, I'm giving a history lesson. Mm, mm -hmm. So you can see the smoke, okay? Yeah. It's a little smoky, but you don't want to worry about that. Don't, then, be careful, don't burn your, your hands. I'm fine, I'm fine. You know when you've done this a few times, it's mm. like a chapati maker. Mm. Here it is. Mm. Of course, when I told my wife about this, mm. she was freaked out. Oh. Especially if you do this in America, they don't know this stuff. Who, who is it? You have a, a, a disgusted look on your face. No, I'm fine. I'm fine. Even if it goes like that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Mm. Yeah. So you have to be careful. Yeah. You have to be careful. Mm. Now, this one is okay. Okay. Now. Is ready. That's fine. Yeah, that's mm. fine. That's mm. ready. Now. What, 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 what's the next step? The next step that we're going to be doing is we're going to get this ready for cooking okay so we get a nice saucepan okay i think this would be good enough yeah you prepare the tomatoes okay let that's me fine you get the tomatoes you. and the sure. onions mm -hmm. but you know this is a man's meal okay mm. uh, yeah this is this is a man's meal you understand yeah mm, not, not too it's not so much you know soft soft people because hey. mm, 
When you look at it, it's a serious meal. It cures hangover. Ah, no, 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 no. It's just good nutrition. Mm. Uh, for me, when I grew up eh, in mm. my village in Masaka, mm. I grew up with a single mother. My mother was what? Was a single woman. Okay. And, you know, she, she used to take me to school with her and then used to go in the gardens with her, mm. would dig. Mm? Mm -mm. Nowadays, people see me speaking English. They don't know where you've come they from. They don't know where I've come from. So anyway, I grew up in Masaka, mm -hmm. Narozali. It's, mm. a whole, it's, a, it's a long way. So that's where I grew up. And I'm from a family of eight children. I had two sisters. I even went to an all-girls primary school. <laughs> you were the only boy. I was the only boy. Why? And all the girls would be so interested in me. At the break time, all the girls would come and look at me. So anyway, that's my village growing up in Masaka. In Masaka. So you're in Uganda. I'm in Uganda. You don't even look. I don't look like in Uganda. Do you have any mixed blood somewhere? Do I have what? Do you have mixed blood somewhere? Yeah, mixed blood. Mm. I think so. I think my father was a Muslim in Uganda. You do know your father? No, I never knew my father. My father was thrown out by Idi Amin in 1971-72. So people used to, you know, People used to have problems, little kids used to call me mm. Magobaga Uganda. I've been teaching men that the best place for husband and wife to get better relationship that can even lead to better sex and intimacy, men must be in the kitchen. Because when women see me, I mean, when my wife sees me in the kitchen, <laughs> ay, 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 hey. she's really happy. <laughs> I was going to school in Philadelphia. Is the heat too much? I, I think it's down. a bit too much. Let's turn it down. There we go. A little bit low. That's good. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. So field. when I was going to field school field. in Philadelphia, we'll yeah. put that over there. Okay. You don't want to worry too much about being too clean. Okay. When you're a guy. So when I was going to school in Philadelphia, I used to help out in the kitchen. Mm. Because some people don't think, I mean, here I am in America. This is many years later okay. in America with my wife. She works in the day, I work at night, but the time only little time, all of us are working. It's, it's a little easy for you to understand that it's okay for a man to be in the kitchen because you have a white woman. An American white, yes. Exactly, that, that changes your perspective, it changes the way you think. But the African man, Mchiga married to Mchiga woman, mm. he doesn't step in the kitchen. But I'm telling you, so it's even where me, I'm still from. African. It's where you've come from. I may be married, I may have married an American. Mm. My DNA, the systems, operating systems, they are all African. In fact, when I was there peeling in the kitchen, I'm wondering, what are people going to think about me? But I learned that, you know, the rewards are better. Mm. Yeah. The rewards are good. Careful, so so, so what you do, you go ahead and put some little oil, mm. okay, to make sure that uh, your, your onions are going to be well taken care of. Okay. And you let the oil cook for a while. Now, while you're doing that, while the oil is sitting over there, mm. it can be time to start peeling. Give me that. Give yeah. Me that. It can be time to start peeling your what? Your cassava. Now, what we're starting over here is the journey to making a chibeo. Now, by the way, I'm not advertising bell beer. <laughs> Are you this fisherman in uh, Abavubi, hey. eh? Hey. They don't have too much time for everything. So they just mix everything. They just throw everything in the saucepan. Have you seen the bodies of fishermen? Yeah. Have you ever seen a fat, overweight fisherman? No, 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 no. They are always very... They are trim. They are always lean. No? Yes. Mm. Well shaped and everything. You mix it. By the way, it is also... Sometimes you, 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 you waste too much time. Yeah. For me, I like to get it. I throw it in. Mm -hmm. Boom! And you go and do something else. This cassava is too hard. Oh. This is too hard. Try that yeah, That one is too hard. Mm. Uh, so we'll try another one. That cassava was a bit too hard. We'll get another one. I think this one is better. Oops. There we go. So what you do then when you've, when you've got this one in, then you throw in the onion. Yeah. Woo! The sound of music. Okay. <laughs> so you let the onions go in for a little bit of time. Okay. Ooh. You stir them up. And then you want to throw in some spices in a bit, some curry powder. I love curry powder. Simba, <laughs> <laughs> How do you Bam! even know what you're saying? <laughs> <laughs> huh? 
Bono Mazari, no take a walk as a cocoa with you. Bam! without pushing the tomato. Ah, uh, uh, not yet. You put it, me, I put it in first. This is also sort of like a chibero molokoni. Bam! A joke, sir. Can you see this thing, man? Woo! You, you can, come bring it up and take a look at this thing. So when you are done over there, mm. then you also throw in the. Let's, let's increase the fire mm? because now this flame is getting a bit too slow. Mm, you increase. I remember going to New York City mm. with my wife. Man, those guys cook real fast and they cook over flames. How long have you been married? Twenty-one years now. Twenty years. I got married in 1992. I was a reckless guy. I was a breakdance champion of East Africa. Are you serious? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I can do more than cook. I can even break dance. So that was when, when I was one. Ooh. When I was a teenager, you know, I really needed Jesus. So as that one is working its way, simmering in there. Okay. Mm? Mm. Molokoni. Mm. Woo! Mm -mm 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 -mm. I also hear it's good for sexual performance. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> so, uh, of that. course, everybody, people, people have all sorts of ideas. <laughs> that, <laughs> no. that, uh, but uh, I don't know. What uh, is in it that, that ups the sexual energy? Just the energy, muscles. <laughs> the muscles. <laughs> it just gives you more muscle power. Hmm? <laughs> yeah. It just gives you more muscle power mm. and uh, to do other things also. So, yeah. so, uh, so while, while this is working in, mm. you put in a little bit of water, as okay. you can see. Mm. Then you throw in garlic. Okay. You have garlic powder. Yeah. Yeah, garlic is good for controlling the heart. Mm. It's also good for high blood pressure. Yeah. You throw it in. Mm. Okay. Then you, you, you let it simmer for mm. some time. Mm. Add a little bit of water as you go along. Okay can use this very same water okay okay so there we go now we can leave it to work its way for a little bit of time mm. meantime now we are going to move to the next area the next section is going to be making the echibelo buliruola waza kukufumba ya waza fortune buto wa sente ntono dala muangwa kutambuza muyonjo asike envazabu lichika chipsi sumbusa enkoko nebila la vinji Atenga alina kalosa akomule mbe. Omutindo kwa fortune buto. Gwa kakasiwa atenga akule wa mbintu vya wano. Geta bunambilo wa gulira fortune buto. Asabiki duwa mungere yomu lembe. Muka sacha tika miliri tebitano. Omufumbio wenja ulo akula fortune buto. Yeka! <coughs> ok, so what we're going to do, we're going to use this to get our cassava mm, mm? Mm. and i'm not the most organized person let's let's agree that one okay but i don't need to be organized my my wife is very organized in the family so you get uh, the cassava as we've done before mm. i think we've got it up mm. there we go this one this one is not very good so if the cassava is like that eh? yeah you don't cook it so we have this one mm. So this cassava is great. What we are going to do is we will cut it up. Mm. Akatogo. Mm. Akatogo kamu. The katogo is going to go complete with even tomatoes and stuff. Mm. Or it's just well, in the kodja kuraba sumurura sumurura botunula. Katogo mari di zawa no. Ingo bute ma te ma mu ko really te te chifa yo but o kuyamba ko ubo ina time constraint. Hmm. O di menya menya mu. Katogo la chibero phase one. Katogo mari di zawa no. To get up with phase two, mm. let's clean this up and throw it in. That cassava is not good, okay. And that one goes in there. Mm? <laughs> yeah, that okay. cassava is not the best. Mm. Yeah, this one will be over there. This one will save for later. Mm. 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 Ka blue barn, cut from the gun, cut butter, can of cabuto, cut a cocoa, cumuchi, 
funa ke kijiko kitono nnyo mm. no funa katono nnyo no teka ko mungalo mm. that is to to take uh, make sure the sap doesn't get hey. doesn't stick amasafu gale me kuingira ko chi kungalo oba masanda hey. uri tenga masanda ne kanu kajanga kana kana kasoka kane ne kajja kola mm. kaje bijo kola tufuna yone kachi engeri ya kavera vera mm. tukateka tuleme kuono na ekisenge kya fichi yo mm. ya chite kaone kati botani kokuwa ata matoke ga figa no gauli acha pula pula buti mhm noja mhm emu kati i was trying to teach my wife mm. how to peel oh yeah i was about to ask that yeah mm. well my wife is from long island new york she's okay. born in manhattan she's born in manhattan Ma -ha manhattan <laughs> how does and me and me i'm born in narozari mm. So she knows how to make pizza, she knows how to make lasagna, she knows how to make roast con pollo because you know part of our family is from Puerto Rico. Mm. Okay? Oh. But me, mm. I'm from Naruzar, is anyone Naruzar man? So in New York. Hey. So I was trying to teach her, of course, I would end up she would end up cutting mangling the matoke and then I would end up mangling the pizza. Mm. So we agreed that when we are cooking matoke at home, and they just she does the cooking. She does the I do the matoke. She okay. does the chicken. Oh, okay. mm. She does the pizza, and I do the matoke. For one vinachi, a matoke. I really love matoke. My yeah. wife told me that I could even have matoke in the morning, mm. in the afternoon, Which and in the said. evening, mm. Mm. as long as there is curry powder. Oh, <laughs> okay. Mm. and men can cook many things but there are certain things that men enjoy yeah huh? mm. of course you may say well, there's not too much order to a chibero mm. <laughs> but it doesn't need that order as long as it's good okay as yeah. long as it's good we're gonna be all right okay mm. Mm. and give you energy and strength so my wife does that uh she is an excellent baker of cakes okay in fact if i can people need to know even as you are seeing me, my wife can bake. <laughs> <laughs> my wife can bake cakes. Huh? In fact, when you start a show on women, I mean, really showing off what they can do, you have to bring her in because she. Yeah, yeah, she, yeah, she can. She can really do some really good stuff. Kati, boma ze amatokago, then olio toko bumonde buno, bumonde buzungu. Bubu Maliza na wano usulamu. Simanyi, simanyi wachi babu tuma bumonde buzungu na yibabu itachi. Babu ita bumonde buzungu. I don't want to call it Irish potatoes. I don't know if the Irish are the ones who brought it. Oh, that's the house. These are the Irish potatoes. So, that's what we do. Now, you know, most of the time, my wife and I have been working at Makere University. My wife mentors young women she teaches them um how to be a good wife yeah. how to be a good mother mm. how to be um an upright woman, an upright woman how to dress properly yeah. i mean really i'm very grateful to god for my wife mm. Hmm? Mm. and uh as a result of that by the way my wife's mother she's from puerto rico my wife's father is originally from jamaica they live in new york now they moved to las vegas so often when we go to visit my other side of the family, mm. we go to Las Vegas. So I think you are good over here. What we're going to do, we can put that on the side. The next thing we are going to do is we are going to make sure that um, we put this chibelo, okay? And we're going to roll it up. What do you mean roll it up? We're going to roll it up, put it in a saucepan, oh. okay? You want a big saucepan? Yeah, let's get a big saucepan over there. I think the other one is good. Is that going to go, okay? Much, much is that a much bigger one? Mm. This is it. This is what I wanted. Now, remember, the echibero ends up as a great recipe. So what we're going to do, let's wait, start this one. Wait, the echibero has this y and that? Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, <laughs> so first of all, I got to say, okay, I'm going to take a look at the echibero. Nolo kote kamuchi, obu monde wafe. Hey. Hey, Ngogeno kole chibero. Mm. Ote kamuchi no, ote kamu mixture. Yonobi te kamu. Mm. Amba katinga Uganda we tuli wano. 
nje tuina ebisera tuina binji chofunye chote kamu in fact nebo bo funye chi winzo kufuna ne juni now you can see it's been simmering for some time mm. Mm. this is after a few hours mm. and then you can begin to see the skin mm. chibero no problem so oh, did i burn you again <coughs> why don't you come on this side yeah Ah. Hmm? Mm. Yes. Mm. Mm. Kati, if you want to know how to test this thing, you touch the mm. mm. You lick the thing. Mm. You smell it. You smell it. You it. You smell it. I mean, if you see an idiot walking around with his underwear going beneath the equator, you need to understand that that fellow, his, his mind is not working. Well. You cannot get, uh, you can't get a man who is discombobulated. So, I'm not married, but when I start so, so looking... So, are, are, you, are you single? Yeah, I'm you are looking for a man. I'm not looking, and I'm not. Uh, are not you being looked for? Are you are being looked for. Definitely. Don't, don't go for that kind of a man. You'll be home alone, and the man will be out in the gal in the golf watching soccer, what what. And even for me, I tell guys, look, if you are staying away from your wife watching soccer, mm. ah, it's ready. Mm, it looks really ready. Let's get that knife. Mm. Ofumitako. Ah. Hey, I know I got Ofumitako in that. Mm. <laughs> but. Man. Ay, ja, 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 ja. Kakati. No, you're going to take him. Hey, I come back. I turn back. I talk, talk, talk. I'm going to Chibero. Chibero. Ay, 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 ay. Originating Kai, from where? Uh, you know, recipe, young. This is my original recipe. Okay. Yeah, it is a mixture mm, mm -hmm. of my life experiences in mm. Zambia police <laughs> barracks. As I grew up, the, I, okay, I okay. spent some years in police barracks mm. in Zambia. It's a mixture of many tribes, Acholi, Langi, Basoga, Naigiro, Lusogo, Lusoga, Nridi, Narigiro. Yeah. Can men cook? Yes, of course, men can cook. What are you talking about? Hmm? Huh? Men can cook. Gloria. Let me watch my saying? Of course, you know, some people talk as if for us we don't know. Mm. But you know what? I can always talk with my American accent. You know oh, what yeah? I'm saying? Yeah. This is great stuff. Sure. Now some black people call this, you know, maybe soul food. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so they call it soul food or they call it chitlins. It doesn't matter, but it's uh native food. This is my recipe, it's called a chibello. Now, I want to serve you Thank so that you. you can be able to experience it. First, you get the... Give me the small part of a chibela, do I think? Well, we're going to get... No, no, you don't want to get a small part. No. Here's where you go for the big one. What? Uh, you want to go for the big one. Oh, my God. That's it. Yeah, you got to go for the big one, Gloria. You don't, don't, don't be worried. Come on. Then you get supu. Hmm? Supu is what makes you strong. My mom held my mouth open. I refused to, to eat, eat it. Stuff. Yeah, this is going to be great. This is going to be great. It's going to be great. That's so, right. you put it over there. First, let's get another plate. Okay. And uh, we're going to be able to have this. This is the best thing in the world. Mm. But you know now, don't tell my doctor okay. about this because my doctor told me told not, to eat this. not to have too much protein. Because okay. you know when men get to be about 45? No, 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 no. Mm. We get gout. Oh yeah, yeah gout is when you have too much extra protein. Yeah, 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 sure. So he told me not to eat much protein. Oh no 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 diabetic is carbohydrates. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. So when when you get a chibero like this, eh? Mm. I don't eat it every day, but it's something I really, really like. Eh? Mm. Yeah. So um don't tell my doctor. Uh -uh. Eh? Doctor doctor the man pastor Yakozech. Yakoze yeah, chibero. 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 Mm. Yeah. And this thing man can even stay there, you eat it in the morning. This is gonna be mine.
Oh my God. All those guys who are going to come to get about to get, Can I have like two of you guys? Yeah, get another plate. Get another plate. I'll serve them. Hmm? Hey. Yeah, man, I so you know what? I mean, first you smell it. Hey big man, how you doing? Good to see you. Meno Chirawa. Oye Chiri. Kadigena kuso ni namna ya man na oberewo eh. Tugena kufunia plate yo. Ye chibero. Jino eh? Kadmana wo maginga okola nyo nyo ba weta gachi, ba weta gachi, ba weta ge chibero. You can't test this. I need you to test this. Mm, she's coming. She's coming. Of course. Hmm? Yeah, Chiri. Yeah, get, get me a knife. Wash your hands. Wash your hands. Okay. Hey, Father, thank you so much for this Chibero. Thank you that you gave me a miracle recipe for Chibero. I pray that even people are watching this, they will also enjoy our African uh, recipes. Give us more strength in the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. 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 It's okay. Mm. Mm. Oh my God. Mm. Ah. I should start making this. Mm. Mm. You guys, mm. it's I, I won't stand over mm. here. Mm. Mm. Try this one. Try the big one. Mm. 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 Oh, oh, I want to taste some. Oh, 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 oh. It doesn't look very nice, but let me taste. This is really great. Mm -hmm. So, Gloria. Yes, Pastor. My favorite recipe that I want to show you mm. was this one. I spent some time in the kitchen, mm. but what I really have problems in the kitchen is washing up. So, usually that's my. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't, I don't want to go very far yet, but mm. respect a lot of it mm. for for reaching out and trying to 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 untaint what has been tainted because society has gone to the dogs. Mm. Mm? Mm. You are you still doing the fight or you freaked out after you had to do community work? Community service? No, 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 no. We, and you then you know you mm. had I, you receive a lot of hate mail. I'm mm. thinking from people. So we always had fights when I was little, but he managed to make me eat it. You saw for yourselves, he can cook. I always tell you that I'll be bringing more and more of these people to grace your screens and show you how they do their stuff in the kitchen. Till next time, bye.